Well, good morning. I'm somewhere lost and gone, Tennessee, by the Nolichucky River. I'm out traveling with my son. We're here for the Viking Canoe Club's annual beginner's clinic. And I just looked at the little section of the river here where we're going to take the new guys out on. And I can't imagine a more beautiful place to start whitewater kayaking. And don't know what's going to happen today. I'm filming this on the new GoPro. We're going to put it on the helmet to see if I can stay upright long enough to get some film on the water. So stick around. It should be fun. There's a guy. Hey, what's up? Good morning. Good morning. Say good morning to YouTube. Yes, sir. Oh, look at this, look at this. Check it out, the sun does rise. Uh -huh. Well, camp is starting to wake up. The Vikings are out and about. And there is rumors of breakfast, which is sounding really good before we get out on the water. I was sitting here talking to the part-time security guard. Yep. Nobody yep. can go in there. The lady that works here asked me. That's exciting. Or told me. She told me, will you keep everybody out of there? Well, that's right. You got your security dog with you. That's right. Yeah. We so, got to protect breakfast. Yeah, I guess they're going to do it in there. She said she was a caterer. Well, I found my ball chasing buddy anyways. We got no ball, we got a stick. Yeah, good job, good job. Go. Get all your five things. You need your boat, you need your paddle, you need your life jacket, you need your helmet, <laughs> and you need a striker. <laughs> oh, okay, Teresa's got extra helmets and life jackets. Yes. And paddles. Oh, and paddles, okay. Um, so five things, and if, if anyone needs help, if anyone hasn't sat in their boat and like adjusted it to their bodies, um, we can work on that this morning too, so just let one of us know. Raise your hand if you are an instructor or kind of know what you're doing. I know that's a, that's a hard question, but... Um, kind of. So anyone with their hand up can help you adjust your boat. Um, so that's really that's really a good place to start, so that your hips are in there good, and you can you can make the boat do what you want instead of the boat doing it to you. Your hips don't lie. Hips don't lie. Um, so yeah, we'll get. So we've been running around in circles looking for the takeout on this little section of river. Right here, Spalding. <laughs> Which obviously it makes us great instructors. Spalding and Aaron took us out on the water and started in on the basics, braces, eddy outs, and some ferrying. They really worked this new crew, getting them ready for the river. It was good work and good training. Started on me. Mirror what? I don't like the way you're saying that. You look like you're having too much fun. Now now you threw an old man in. This is getting worse. Step and spin around. No, that, that hook into the eddy, yeah. that's a move you don't use. I do some. You don't very often. But I would follow it with the paddle stroke on this side just to throw me up. Well, it depends on what I... On this, it doesn't matter so much, but something bigger. Yeah, I'm, not, I'm trying not to smack my <laughs> eldest child in the head with a paddle. I can handle it. <laughs> 
Well, the rest of the day consisted of a nice run down some class two rapids, beautiful weather. The uh, students got a chance to use the stuff they learned. My battery ran out on the GoPro, so you're going to miss my crash and burn in the last class three. I kind of wished I'd missed it too. Clinic 2021 comeback tour. Best one yet. That's about it for this one. If you saw anything you like, I hope you'll leave a like. If you like what I'm doing, consider subscribing. And most of all, thanks for watching. That's about it. Except for some pro-real foolishness, 